How did the California Gold Rush come about, you ask? Well, my name is John Sutter. I was born in Candern, a few miles from the Swiss border, on February 15, 1803. When I was 31 years old, I left my wife and children to look for a fortune in America. When I got to California, I wished to receive a land grant. Therefore, I had to become a naturalized Mexican citizen. In 1841, I was granted around 48,827 acres. Sutter's Fort was built on this land and finished in 1844. The fort was just a simple building made out of adobe bricks and it had some very tall walls around it. We were protected by cannons. My fort was a trading post for those crossing the Sierras. I began hiring local Indians to sow and harvest my crops. The farm animals grazed near the fort. Hunters went out to collect big game and fur, and we produced tools in the blacksmith's shop. I needed lumber, so I put James Marshall in charge of my sawmill, which I called Sutter's Mill. James and some mill workers set out to build the mill in Coloma, California, in September of 1847. In 1848, James discovered some gold in the American River during the time he was working on the mill. Surprisingly though, this was not as good for him as everyone would have thought. It seemed that miners came from all over once the gold was discovered. Half of the miners came by land. They came from the eastern states to California. The other half of the miners came by sea from Latin America, Australia, Europe, and China. The miners took every piece of land in the area. James Marshall was forced to move off his property, and even the mill was taken. I lost everything at the fort. The miners ruined my crops and stole everything else I had. I was sitting in my office one day, thinking of all I had lost and made the decision to leave the madness and reunite with my family up north at Hawk Farm. Conditions for the miners were very poor. They were lonely, hard workers who had little to eat. A lot of miners became sick while they were on the gold fields. To find any happiness through all of this, miners would spend their time gambling with one another and finding things to laugh about. We call these people the 49ers. They were dedicated to finding their fortune in and along the American River. They didn't realize how tough it would actually be. And to think, all this came about because I told James Marshall to go and build the sawmill.